Well, today we have something special for you planned, unique army composition at that for the Town Hall 9 level. This is so crazy. This is a go weebo la ba. Go weebo la ba. I guess that's how kind of my acronym using golems, wizards, bowlers, lava hounds, and baby dragons <laughs> and loons. Is that. I mean, it's crazy. This is a crazy strategy. Uh, so ground attack first with the queen. Now, of course, the the point here is to kind of create the funnel t um, for some of his the king uh, and the bowlers. Of course, that's very important. But by the time he drops the bowlers and the king, look at this. Let's see how it works out. He's going to drop a rage on those bowlers, which will do tons of damage, and the poison on the clan castle. But look, this ground attack is going to take out so many units. He's using a lot of spells at the ground attack. The, the queen's going to go down. Some expos are going to go down. I think he's going to get one expo down, uh, but and take out the clan castle. So very huge portion of this raid going, you know, uh, getting destroyed at the early onset. He got was able to get two air defenses as well. The king is still up as well. The bowl, bowlers just died now. So very cool attack if you're looking for kind of a widespread of units trying to find something a little different of course he, he look he only has a, a haste and a rage for his air portion but it's okay he was able to get down three air defenses actually um i think or, or two or three i can't remember uh, before his air portion was able to come into the attack. So very strong stuff. Uh, the ground portion was able to really take down a lot. So and also gets a nice effective use of these baby dragons, which I did uh, in my a couple videos back. I did one on using a baby dragon to create a funnel. I know a lot of people like using dra baby dragons to use that funnel because they do better than some um, other units as well. Maybe a giant or a lot of people like to use Valkyries too, to one Valkyrie to create that funnel. Uh, but look at this, great attack, still has plenty of hounds left. Now, the danger here was getting that three star. The hounds didn't burst because there were so many air defenses taken down with the ground portion. I mean, bowlers in the uh, uh, one golem, and uh, it's so powerful in those, that king and queen. So let's get you another raid here just because I want to show you the different strategies you know it, it's it's I like clash if you we can get a variety of attacks going on I haven't used air in a long time because air is not that great at town hall 10 uh, because Valkyries are way better even bowlers are better than air so I'm really hoping that they'll bring air back somehow I don't know how they could do that maybe uh, beefing them up a little bit but look at this this is so powerful guys come on he's creating the great funnel with his golem there comes the bowlers and he's gonna drop a rage and the jump spell and the poison kind of the same sort of strategy uh, as as the first attack and with this attack it just goes so well the the, the, the ground portion rips through this base uh, and it's amazing. It's just a, so fun to watch this happen. I mean, you can have these kind of three-stage attacks. So he has got the ground stage, then he's got the air stage. I guess two-stage attack, which I think Supercell was intending to do with the kind of onset of the uh, when they made some of the updates recently. He did clump those baby dragons together, so not smart there. So they really didn't have the, the firepower that they should have, that rage. But it's okay. He was able to just take out the whole entire base, dropped in the loons and the la loon portion perfectly. And so uh, this base is taken down pretty easily, uh, if you ask me, pretty easily. So Again, Beastman shows you. I, I, Beastman loves using dragons. Um, he did the baby dragon video that I did a couple um, videos ago. If you haven't seen that, give that a go, and you'll like that strategy. Town Hall 10 versus Town Hall. Um, I mean, sorry, Town Hall 9 versus Town Hall 11. He took down. Anyways, there you go. Some great attacks, friendly challenges. This is the place to use the friendly challenge. You got to just practice, 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 and everything will go well. Practice makes perfect, right? Now here is attack that is the one star. So what went wrong on this attack? Of course, I showed you two three stars, and you can't three star all the time. So what happened here that didn't happen in the previous videos? Kind of same sort of base layout, uh, but the key that I found, of course, again, perfect funnel. Look at that. 
unfortunately, though, look, the bowler, I mean, those wall breakers didn't break into the compartment that he wanted. And because of that, I think it kind of created a little confusion for those bowlers. Um, so uh, that's kind of what happened. The jump spell just barely getting into the core of the base. But the main difference here, the ground portion was really s stopped. And cold in its tracks, I think mainly because, uh, you know, he wasn't able to take down as many air defenses as he wanted. Uh, and this is a Town Hall 10, <clears throat> but really at 9.5. Uh, but, see, the ground portion wasn't quite as strong as usual. And the air portion, he was just a little bit sloppy on some of his placement. Uh, and that was kind of the real downfall. Again, he wasn't able to take out one of those expos as well, and that was a really critical fail. So I think the main port portion of why this attack failed, the ground portion didn't get those expos that it needed. And the last two, if you remember, he, some of them he got two expos down, but he definitely got one expo. You've got to get those expos down, or, you know, he would have three-starred if he got the expos down. So, anyways, thanks again for watching. Please try the strategy out. The go wo, go we bo la ba. Go we bo la ba. <laughs> try saying that three times. Anyways, thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time. Hey, folks.